<clears throat> well, hello Libra, and welcome to your horoscope. So, what does Sagittarius time represent to Libra? Well, it represents a time where we're looking at our neighborhood, our friends, where we grew up, our, our school years, you know, from late elementary school, I'd say, to, you know, college, pretty much, um, our more basic, formative, foundational stuff, and any friends that we accumulated in that period that we're still in touch with, they're more likely to show up this time, our siblings, if we have younger siblings in particular, very important, and also people who have a lot of stuff um, transiting their third house, they discover, you know, a little bit of poetry, maybe some songwriting, maybe working with your hands more, it becomes more enjoyable. And it's also, I, I consider the transit of blooming where you're planted, identifying where you're from. It's not a bad thing, because I'll tell you what, people, when you love where you live, it empowers your life. So, you know, not everybody can live in San Francisco, all right? You know, that's, I think, a prime piece of real estate. Not everybody can live in Manhattan, you know, or London, or Paris, or, you know, Vienna, or, or Venice, or, you know, a lot of these really desirable urban areas. I know Amsterdam, I should mention you, too. I mean, there's a lot of places I should mention, probably Denver these days, just because of the, the legal weed, but um, I think really, if there are many places that are way more special than all those big flavor of the month places, and... In fact, where you live, you might be able to make it more special. In fact, I know that you can. I think if that's your desire to do that, because that's part of the justice-making thing of Libra. It's like love where you live. It's like more love, right? We all want more love. I mean, come on. It's a more love. You feel better. It's a good thing. It's good medicine, folks. And uh, if you're not feeling that love, I just want to you know, extend an icebreaker, you know, you know, a wish, a prayer that, you know, things would be good for everybody. Uh, that everyone's most intimate desires could be fulfilled. Ooh. Sounds delicious, secretive, and, and um, you know, almost scandalous, but whatever it takes, you know. As my friends in the band, um, the California Honey dr <laughs> what is it, the California Honey Drops? I think it's something like that, would say. Something like, I can't even... Ca quote it because then you know it might be some kind of weird infringement so I won't say it I think there's a band they say something funny that I like Libra you too say something funny that I like write it in a poem a play a song um, and uh, learn to bloom where you're planted and and feel that and love your family and know that your family love is really significant with Venus's transit in the fourth it's not going away from there, so we have to train, change the way we look at things. It's never too late for a happy childhood, seriously.